Hey, my fellow mathematician, welcome to a study of numerical analysis. Today's video focuses on a subtopic finite difference, and specifically, we want to look at how do you obtain that forward difference. Uh, we, we write it as this symbol change power 3 fx. This to stand for that forward difference. The that forward difference can be written as this first difference into bracket, second difference of function of function x. Now, second derivative of function x is written as this f of x plus 2h minus 2 bracket f of x plus h or now to write second forward difference you can check in my channel so that you may know how it is written plus f of x then we distribute this operator which is which is distributive we distribute it through uh, this one so far this operator of f of x plus 2 minus 2 the, op the first operator of f of x plus 2 plus this operator of f of x. So when you operate f of x of x plus 2, it will be the front point is f of x plus 3h minus f of x plus 2h. This is for this part. Then f of operator of one difference of of f of x h is given by f of x will be uh, given by f of x plus 2 h minus minus f of x plus h uh, that way then plus the front difference of of f of x is f of x plus h minus f of x. Then clearly you can see f here we have one f of x plus two h and we have two f of x plus two h. So we combine these two to obtain f of x plus three h minus three f of x plus two h. Then we have two. This will be minus and minus will be plus two f of x plus h plus 1 f of x plus h which will be 3 so plus 3 f of x uh, f 3 f of x plus h and finally minus the third part function which is f of x so generally this is how we write the third forward difference of function f of x it is written as f of x plus 3h minus 3f of x plus 2h plus 3f of x f of x plus h minus f of x if you are keen these are the coefficient of Pascal's triangle of power 3. Because here we have 1, 3, 3, 1. So the that row of Pascal's triangle, uh, these are the coefficient. Then you master what is happening for the that. The that you are moving up to the small change of x3. The second part, the second and the, the other one to to the to the h and finally f of x so thanks so much for taking your time to study with me on how to write uh, that for the difference i uh, remember this is study of numerical analysis subtopic finite difference on how to study first for the difference second for the difference and the and other foreign differences kindly
take in my YouTube channel on the link below so that we may learn together. If you have not yet, yet subscribed to this channel, kindly remember to do so so that you don't miss a single video which I upload for us every day. Uh, bye bye. See you in the next presentation as we keep on learning.